Weekend Booster is finally here starting April 1st, 2 p.m. ET, and it ends on April 4th, 1.59 e, uh, p.m. ET. And we got double credits. Uh, right now, <clears throat> my voice sounds really bad, and that's because, my, you know, my throat is a little sore. And um, I just haven't been able to release the content that I want right now and recording as well because my voice just sounds terrible and I really am kind of pissed off that it is because it's ruining the content that I want to put uh, put out for you guys. So it really does suck right now and I'm just waiting for my voice to get better. So yeah, if you hear me sounding really bad right now, it is because I'm kind of drained. I'm talking and just in general, I just hate hate the fact that my voice sounds like this right now but you know and it's, I'm, I'm just trying to get this fixed up and uh quick as possible so I could drop some content but yeah double credits is here and I was also thinking about where is the best place to do some double credit farming there's a lot of places right but I think most generally steel path might actually be the better way to get some more credits it could be whether defense mission or a survival mission, or a, uh, let's say, interception mission. They, those those are basically endless missions. Could even be mobile defense, but I think, you know, Steel Path probably might be the better way to get more credits in your, um, in your credits, and make more credits, obviously. But mostly, that's where I just see it. Mostly gain, uh, getting credits is that's where it's from. I mean, you also have... You know, the the best way when it comes down to getting credits is index, of course. However, when it comes down to dedic double credit boosters, this doesn't apply to Neptune, the index endurance, because in here it does not. I don't think it applies to this because you have to do a bunch of um, things like, let's click on this and then. Oh, the uh, the the profits, the the hard stuff in here, you know. So that that's what you're doing. You're doing those trials and stuff, and you can't really the the, the double credit booster does not come to play with that. So it does not it does not help you gain credits because you're getting rewards, not pickups. So yeah, I, I hope hopefully a lot of you know this about this, but you're getting rewards. You're not you're not the credit booster is not helping you get more credits because you're getting rewarded for it. You have to get it picked up, uh, you know, dropping credits, get it picked up, and you'll get more credits. That's how it works. It does not work uh, on rewards because, obviously, that's not a pickup. You're getting rewarded for that. So, hopefully you understand the difference between those. All right, credit boosters do not work like that, especially when you're getting rewarded for endo as well. Um, it does not work like that as well, but rewards from endo are really good as well. So... Um, but yeah, that's really just it. I mean, if you want to use in your double credit booster, you know, definitely uh, still path, you know, do those endless missions. You'll get a lot of credits from those. Um, but the best way is really just index, you know, that's how you get the most credits and do not do still path. Whatever you do, do not do still path. That is the hardest thing you ever want to make it for yourself. Don't make it hard. But yeah. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Follow me on all social medias and Twitch. Links are in the description. Thank you so much for watching. Love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video.